it's been a disappointing season in New England. The Patriots are on the verge of missing the playoffs for the second time in three seasons, and quarterback Mac Jones has shown his frustration. A former Patriot says the second-year quarterback needs to show more poise as the leader of the team. Vince Wilfork, who won two Super Bowls with New England and played in two others, criticized Jones for not being able to control his emotions. Mac Jones of the New England Patriots reacts during the fourth quarter against the Las Vegas Raiders at Allegiant Stadium December 18, 2022, in Las Vegas. Mac Jones of the New England Patriots reacts during the fourth quarter against the Las Vegas Raiders at Allegiant Stadium December 18, 2022, in Las Vegas. Chris Unger slash Getty Images I'm tired of it. You're a leader of this team, you're a quarterback, Wilfork told NBC Sports Boston. You can't be frustrated every single week, every single play. I don't care if you're getting the play call in late or whatever it may be. At this point, I'm tired of seeing it. I think a lot of other people are tired of seeing it, and I'm here to say it, we're tired of seeing it. Will Fork wasn't the only former Pat critical of Jones. Former receiver Julian Edelman had some harsh words too. You know what, he also doesn't practice the antics after plays and waving off coaches and all these little pissy faces and stuff. Like he doesn't practice that, and he does it. Edelman said on Inside the NFL, according to the New York Post. Jones has played it off as passion, but clearly Wilfork and Edelman disagree. Quarterback Mac Jones of the New England Patriots reacts after a play during the second half of a game against the Las Vegas Raiders at Allegiant Stadium December 18, 2022, in Las Vegas. Quarterback Mac Jones of the New England Patriots reacts after a play during the second half of a game against the Las Vegas Raiders at Allegiant Stadium December 18, 2022, in Las Vegas. Chris Unger slash Getty Images The Pats, when Tom Brady was around, made the playoffs in all but one season he played not including 2008 when he tore his ACL in Week 1. So, of course, it's unfamiliar territory for New Englanders. Will Fork and Edelman's comments come after the Patriots suffered an embarrassing loss after a stunning play. Patriots legend William Gynast embarrassed by alleged assault, disappointed in myself. With the game tied at 24, three seconds left on the clock and the Pats at their own 45-yard line in a game Sunday against the Las Vegas Raiders, the Pats could have run the clock out to send the game into overtime. Instead, Jones handed the ball off to Ramondra Stevenson who found a hole. However, Stevenson lateraled to Jacoby Myers to try to come away with a miracle. Myers then launched a backward pass that was intercepted by Raiders edge rusher, and former Patriot, Chandler Jones, who took it 48 yards to the end zone for a walk-off 30-24 victory. Mac Jones, 10, of the New England Patriots reacts after losing to the Las Vegas Raiders at Allegiant Stadium December 18, 2022 in Las Vegas. Mac Jones, 10, of the New England Patriots reacts after losing to the Las Vegas Raiders at Allegiant Stadium December 18, 2022, in Las Vegas. Chris Unger slash Getty Images The Pats are 7-7 and on the outside looking in at the playoffs as the 8th seed. The Miami Dolphins hold the 7th and final spot at 8-6.